Hello, hello. Uh, sorry, voice is a little tired. I've been working a lot today. Uh, we have today. Oh, and ignore the bandaid. I just cut my finger. Uh, Fort, the Cats and Dogs expansion. Fort is a leader game, which I am a huge fan of leader games. Um, so I definitely got the expansion as soon as I could. Uh, we're going to actually bring out Fort in just a minute. But uh, first and foremost, let's look at this expansion. And uh, we have on each side Fort's Cats and Dogs expansion. It says it on the sides. And then we've got the back. You've begged and pleaded with your parents, and finally, it's time to get a pet. This, is, this expansion of Fort adds two modules, dogs and cats. You can use one or both. No, this guy right here, that's a good cat. All right, let's crack into this. I made the rookie mistake of not tearing the tear strip ahead of time, but thankfully this one actually works because Leader Games makes good stuff. So I can trust that their stuff will be easy to open, usually. Ugh, there's always that last little bit with the tear strip that doesn't come away. There we go. Oh no, I folded the corner a little bit. That's fine. I'm probably not gonna, I'm not gonna throw out the tuck box, but I'm not gonna, you know, store it in here if I can help it, which we'll get into in just a minute. So we have uh, the tuck box, which is classic tuck box, nothing special there. We got the small cat cards have the tuna can on the back then we have the tiny little rule book explaining the modules which is only like well it's seven seven pages plus credits so that's pretty good also it counts the front page as one of the pages so don't gotta worry as much about that then we got the dog cards which are more standard size cards with the fort back we got uh one dog house per character color player color rather and each one has a reference on it explaining how to use it in this expansion. So let's let's assess the quality compared to the original. First and foremost, I'm just going to punch these out so that we have them all punched out. Punched out nice and clean. Appreciated. Then these are all little fold cases. Which is good in case you, you know, want to keep them separate, but within the box. Mmm. That feels about the same quality. Thankfully, I have the original fort right here. So we can actually directly assess the quality. These are very high quality pieces in the original. Look at this. It's got the nice little insert bit. I love that. And... It has a great deal of open space for an expansion. So that's wonderful. So yeah, let's see. This is an original Fort card, and this is the new one. Colors and everything look the same. This one feels a tiny bit glossier, just a little bit. You know, it's it's not too noticeable, but I'm 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 paying very close attention right now. And yep, yeah, printing and cutting is identical so you will not be able to tell an expansion card from a regular card going off of the back so that is always great and then let's see how well these fit into the original box because what's what's the point of the expansion if you can't expand into the original box so here we go yep tucks perfectly on top of the deck there's like a little bit of area but if i were to take this out i think it would fit perfectly right on top of the uh, normal fort deck awesome and i will uh check the quality of the smaller cards real quick before i put all of it into the full box okay oh yeah some good kids some very good uh. Dumpling. Jitters. Ah, I love these guys. Kingsley. Wonderful, wonderful crew. So those are more in line with the size of these. So let's see how the quality compares. 
Hmm. These feel more identical. There was only the tiniest difference in the other ones, and it's not a visual one. It's just this very small, like, tactile one. Yeah, this is a little dinged up. I've played it a few times now. And size-wise, perfectly squared. Oh, wait. I think the cat one... Now that's square, that's square. For a second, I thought the cat one might have been the absolute tiniest, tiniest bit wider, but no, 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 that was just my imagination. So let's tuck these away. Those are the ones for the cat cards. That's why it was such a tight fit. Here are the ones for the base game cards. Tuck, tuck, tuck away. All right. That's neatly in there. Was there? There wasn't a divot on that side, but that's okay. So these should all fit quite nicely. Yeah, all fits very nicely into the uh, the open slot that was included originally. In fact, I'm curious, would the tuck box fit in there? Could I just put it all back in the box? Yes, the tuck box fits perfectly into that slot. I that fills me with great happiness. So, I will I will probably be storing it like that. That's very cool. But uh yeah, that's this expansion. So, I hope this lets you know if this is an expansion you'd like to get, I'd recommend Fort for certain very fun deck building game, probably my favorite to be honest. Love the pieces, love the concept, love just, you know, how everything works together and of course i love the art oh big boy because it's kyle farron kyle farron is probably my favorite now full-on favorite board game artist currently working love love his work love pretty much every game he's worked on at the very least for the art you know so That'll do it for this one. Please follow me on Twitch, twitch.tv slash IggyKid, where I stream uh, some leader games sometimes. I stream a lot of Oath. Um, I'll probably stream some Fort if I can get a game going sometime, you know, just to try this out in the digital space. I, I stream on there quite a bit. You can also find past games of Oath and such, and like Root, which was another leader game on Iggy Kid Twitch Archive, which I'll link now. And what was the other one? Oh, yeah, Twitter at Iggy D Kid. Follow me there. Probably going to do some stuff on TikTok. When I do, I'll be sharing it to Twitter. So follow me on Twitter for now, and that's how you'll find that. So be sure to like, comment, subscribe. Let me know what games you'd like to see. Uh, I plan to do reviews eventually. They're just more work, so I need to find time to do so. But uh, yeah, when I do reviews, let me know what games you'd like me to review. This will definitely be... All the ones I have or have unboxed will be included in all of those eventually. So... Thank you very much for watching. Have fun playing whatever game you play. Hopefully this one. This is a, this is a good one. Okay. Goodbye. Goodbye.